Let's discuss what is to come, what happened today with Mr. Trump supporting the insecure Speaker of the House, the two of them announcing that our election has a problem, and they know how to fix it, voter ID. Let's discuss that and more with Trump's 2016 deputy campaign manager, David Bossie, also the co-chair of the 2024 Republican National Convention Committee on Arrangements. Dave Bossie, thank you for joining me, especially on a Friday. Oh, my pleasure to be here, Chris, as usual. What's your take on the payoff case? Well, first of all, I, it's pretty outrageous. You just did the comparison to murder. I, I don't understand. I, I was trying to oh, figure no, no, out no, where not. you were going. No, I'm not. Trump was no, a murderer, not. No, not. but I, 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 no, I lost no, that. No, I'm not. 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 Dave, let me help you out, brother. I'm saying it's not like O.J. because that was a murder case. I ended on the question. But I'm now, trying to Trump, figure out why you did that. <laughs> Oh, here's That's why. what I'm trying I, to get you should, here. You, you should like, you should be doing it. <laughs> and I'll tell you why. Because the whole theory of the case is it's not about whether or not he did it. The system was set up to frame Trump and to get him out of political contention. And that's what this payoff case with Bragg is about. That was the argument in OJ that, yeah, he yeah. did it, but you're going after him because you want the black man to go down, even though he's a celebrity. And this happens all the time. That's my argument. I can't. That argument, I, I, I understand w what you're saying. And Bragg and Letitia James and these malicious prosecutors in Georgia, uh, this crazed Jack Smith, these people are, they've just, they're destroying the very fabric of our democracy, what they're doing, in claiming that Trump is, in fact, a threat to our democracy. They are, in fact, destroying the very fabric that holds this country together, that that bl justice is blind. And that what they have done here and what Bragg is doing when he could have done this years ago and the president, President Trump, would have been exonerated then uh, or found guilty by the look, we all know what's going on in, in New York. OK, we all see it with our own eyes. The American people are rejecting it resoundingly. Why do I say that? Because his polling numbers continue to go up. They continue to attack him unfairly. They unmercifully spend, spend his money on lawyers across the country, but yet the American people are rejecting it and they are going towards Trump. Why? Because Joe Biden has no business being in the White House. So we'll get we'll 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 cover all of this, but this is this is an outrage what they are doing. Monday is a circus. It is it is an embarrassment to the United States. I mean the problem is he did it. So I see by the letter of the law why they'd be making the case, but the question is is it about the letter of the law? I have been on record from the beginning. Yeah, that, yeah but, I don't but the, like and, the New York you're, cases. You're, you're right. I no, think no. that they help Trump exactly. more than they hurt them. But and, and, and if you just like the American people do, look at the at, at the timeline. The, these case, yeah, this case I, I get it. was I rejected get the issue. and rejected and rejected and rejected. And only because yeah, right now, this is election interference in an election year. That is all it is. And the American people are figuring it out and they got it. And that's why they're even the these independents, these soft Democrats, these moderate Democrats and independents are gravitating towards Donald Trump for two reasons. One. They're seeing what this legal system, what Joe Biden's Justice Department is doing to Donald Trump on one hand, but and it's so out, it's so outrageous. And on the other hand, they're seeing what Joe Biden has turned this country into in three and a half years, and they're saying to themselves, "We but need two very Donald different Trump things. back in the White House over his policies." Yeah, they, they, look, I wish it were all about the policies. Um, and obviously, that would benefit yes, you guys also because, you know, I, I think you got a very flawed candidate. But if it were just about the policies, you may get independence. Um, maybe even, I don't know about Democrats, but, you know, you would get independence because if it's just about policies, but it's not, it's about people. And concerns about Biden are almost exclusively personal, uh, even among the left, and as are the concerns about Trump. But I don't disagree with you that these New York cases are a bad look at the minimum, and I think they're going to be a distraction and they're going to be a net negative uh, for the kind of collective cause and probably help Trump.
Hey, thank you for watching. Please go to newsnationnow.com, newsnationnow.com, and you can find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button down below. Then you will get more of News Nation's fact-driven coverage.